I got a comment about this in my last video and I thought it actually sounded like a, a good idea to make a guide on this. We're gonna do a little tutorial on how to use uh, more than one hard drive for storing games in Linux because it's not something you'd be used to uh, coming from Windows. But we'll go over it. It's not that bad. Um, I'll just use the uh, KDE partition manager for this. So I'm just going to do this with a USB drive or a USB hard drive that I have. So I'll go to here. And then I will, I'll delete this and then I will make a new partition. If you don't have a specific file system in mind and you're not well versed in the differences, just do ext4. It's it's pretty good all around. Now label, I'll just call this uh, games uh, and then one TB for one terabyte or something. The label doesn't matter much. It's just so you can tell what it is. Then I'll hit OK. Um, now, all right, this will remove any data on the drive because we are formatting it just so you're aware and I'll hit apply. All right, now that that's finished, we just hit OK. It'll rescan everything. Now that shows up the labels games with TV. Now right click on whatever partition you just made, pull up properties and you'll just leave that open for a little bit. You'll want to open your terminal. You'll type sudo. Uh, this gives you admin privileges. Then you'll type nano and slash etc slash fstab. Nano is just a text editor. Then you'll hit enter, type in your password. Then go down to the bottom of this list, type UUID, all caps, and then equals. And then right here, where it says UUID, you will copy and then paste. And then you can hit space and then do. All right, now we need to make a place to put it. So I'll just do sudo kdir and dash p, and then I'll do slash drives and slash games one tb and then I'll hit enter. You don't have to make the same directory I made, just make sure that whatever directory you make, uh, you use the same directory in the fstab file. Now up here, I'll just do slash drives, and then games, one tb. I'll do ext4, and then you'll type defaults, and then comma, and if it's a SSD, you'll add no add time after this. For me, it's not. So I'll just do, I won't. And then if this is an external drive, something you plug in through USB, you'll want to add no fail. And then just do space and then zero, space, zero. Then hit control X, hit Y to save, enter, and you can exit out of that. Now we'll just want to uh, sudo mount dash A. Then if that doesn't spit out any errors, you should be good to go. It should be mounted now. So you'll go to drives and games. You can see our available space changed. So we're on the new drive. Now what we'll do is we'll give ourselves ownership of that drive. So just do capital uh, sudo and C-H-O-W and then capital R your username and then do slash drives slash games one tb then hit enter now if we open that back up and we go to properties for this go to permissions we can see under ownership we own this file now i'll open steam okay now just go to steam settings downloads steam library folders then you'll click the add button right here then you'll go to drives games one tb You'll hit new folder, we'll just call it Steam Library, then hit select. And there you go. Now you have your second drive to install games on. So thanks for watching. If you liked it, hit the like button. If you want more videos like this, uh, hit the subscribe button. I will see you later.